A power feed for under $100? Unbelievable. Yet here it is, $99.60 delivered to your door. Let's take a look and see what you get for your money. You get this little bearing cap, get the brass gear, drive gear, get a bag full of uh, limit switch stops, get another bag of sleeves and spacers and springs, you get the power feed itself, rapid Travis button, the little speed control dial, built-in circuit breaker, and an off and on switch. The limit switch is pre-wired. Then you get the manual, it's written in Chinese and English. It seems pretty comprehensive. So now let's strap it on the old bridge port and see how it works. Here I'm taking off the handle and the existing bearing cap. We'll be saving the handle and the dial but we'll replace the original bearing cap with the supplied one. Huh. Says we were supposed to put the limit switch on first. We'll back up and do that. So I'm fiddling around trying to get this limit switch bracket on the existing Bridgeport holes and they're not lined up so I'm going to have to go take the air grinder and widen them out a little bit. Strike one. Okay, that's better. Now we can tighten it down. Now we're putting on the new bearing cap. Now the drive motor. Now here's the brass drive gear, and I've got a problem. The keyway in the shaft of the bridge port screw is 0.125, and the brooch slot in the brass gear is 0.117. So I'm going to take it over to the bench now, and I'm going to re-broach it out to 125 wide. Strike two. And now the brass gear slides over the key just fine. So here it is all complete. It's all adjusted and proper shims in place. And it took just a little bit over an hour. And that includes altering the micro switch, broaching out the brass gear, and interruptions caused by my friend Jim calling me, which probably talked for about five or ten minutes. So all in all, not too bad. The manufacturer ended up with two strikes, but 
that's okay. And the only thing that remains to be seen now is how it holds up over time. So I hope you liked this video. And until next time, this is Mike signing out. See ya.